Oh, he was in a ghost net. Ghost nets, of course, are a really big problem up in Cape York. Mm -hmm. So what happens is in the Gulf of Carpentaria, it's like a washing machine. And these discarded fishing nets, which uh, come from everywhere around Indonesia, Asia, Australia, they just go around like a washing machine. Mm -hmm. And they're called ghost nets because you can't see them going through the ocean and they're indiscriminate. They kill, they kill everything. And so this is how this guy got entangled. Got flipper um, yep. entangled and amputated. As you can see, he's still able to swim and they're going to release him soon. But uh, this is a big threat. You know, people need to clean up their trash and to stop dumping their fishing nets in the ocean. We need to look at how we can monitor these fishing nets. So we need patrols up there to look at the nets, also the nets that are washed up on the beach. Tangaroa Blue does a great job of going out there and trying to remove all the nets off the beach, but they need more funding and more help as well. Get these nets off the beach because if they're on the beach, they wash back into the ocean in high tide.